He's lost his greedy mind, poor chap. I want you to take over for his foreign client, this uh, rather eccentric Count Dracula. He's buying a property around London. Of course, sir. I'll attend to the Count. Thank you for your confidence. This is a great opportunity for you, Harker. But you'll have to leave uh, Transylvania immediately. Opportunities such as this come but once in a lifetime. Yes, of course, sir. If I may inquire, what in fact happened to Mr. Renfield in Transylvania? Nothing. Nothing. Personal problems. Close these transactions and your future with this firm is assured. We can be married when I return. <clears throat> of course. All right. Jonathan. Jonathan, I love you. I love you, Mina. Seeing my forefathers to defend the church against all enemies of Christ. The relationship was not entirely successful. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> The luckiest man who walks on this earth is the one who finds true love. You found Mina. I thought she was lost. Where to be married as soon as I return. Are you married, Count? I've seen many strange things already. Bloody wolves chasing me through some blue inferno. <laughs> man himself. Yeah. Look, he's growing young. Was she in great pain? Yeah, she was in great pain. Then we cut off her head and drove a stake to her heart and burned it, and then she found peace. Doctor! Please. <laughs> Doctor, you must understand. I doubted everything, even my mind. I was impotent with fear. I know. But, sir, I know where the bastard sleeps. I brought him there, to Carfax Abbey. No! No, wait! No, let them go! Let them go! Our work is finished here. Hers has just begun. <laughs> 